Hello, doing a quick review here of some Rebel Minis 15 millimeter forces here. We have both the Earth Force Home Guard here, which I use as my conscripts for my DPRG forces in Tomorrow's War. And then as the more experienced and elite troops, we have Rebel Minis Titan Marines here. Both lines have uh, riflemen, commanders, and they both have heavy weapons packs that include uh, heavy energy weapons, rocket launchers, and snipers. Well, one thing I like about the Titan Marines is that they also include a mortar unit here, uh, giving my uh, elite troopers a little more firepower in the field as opposed to the conscripts uh, as the home guard do not have any uh, particular heavy weapons packs although the earth force uh, line does the home guard does not i came across these just a couple uh, days ago in a tray uh, packed away with a bunch of half finished 15 millimeter miniatures the bases hadn't been done, uh, they had uh, putty put on them, uh, and they needed to be uh, painted and flocked to finish them up. Uh, I also found a number of packs of uh, unpainted minis, so these are going to go back into the queue uh, to finish up. Uh, give me a couple of platoons of forces for each, and then uh, off to get some vehicles for them. Little comparison shot here, measuring them up. Both of them are just about uh, 15 millimeters. Uh, and then a tiny bit more once based. The home guard here. Uh, these are uh, great little casts. Uh, very little cleaning uh, needed to get them uh, onto the table. Uh, same thing with the Titan Marines here. Um, prices are great. Uh, Rebel Minis has uh, great service. I've ordered from him quite a few times for both this uh, 15 millimeter stuff and a lot of his 28 millimeter stuff. Um, he still carries a lot of the old Starship Troopers uh, minis in 28 millimeter, either under different names um, or with slight changes. Um, so they are uh, an awesome addition to my 28-ish uh, millimeter uh, sci-fi ranges. So hopefully we're going to be doing more uh, 15 millimeter reviews here in the future, along with uh, some historical and some uh, 28 millimeter sci-fi. Um, so thank you for uh, watching and I hope you guys enjoyed.